Hello, my name is Lindsay, and today I'm going to share with you a hack that I have been using a lot here in Royal High in the dorms. Now, I don't currently have the hack put together currently in my dorm. I put it all away so I can show you how to do it, but I am going to show you how you can change the outside of your dorm, especially since we don't really need to see the balcony since we can't go out there. Now, I usually only do my windows, but I was thinking we could do the balcony doors today because you can't really go out them so you don't really need the balcony doors. I usually have them covered with a curtain but I think this hack that I'm about to show you might be a cheap way to cover the balcony. I went ahead and moved my curtains away from the window. We will put them back after I completed the hack. Now what you will need for this hack are poster boards. So you will need two or three depending on how many of your windows you want to cover. So I can go ahead and get out your poster board. I'm going to put it right here. And now we need to go through the transformations and find a size that will cover the window. So this is a transformation eight. It is almost the perfect size, but if you look up, you can see a little crack right here so size a will not work looks like we will need to use a transformation 11. okay now what you're gonna do is come over to the recolor button and you're going to need the pattern so we need to find patterns that have a landscape that we like i know if you want to have a beachy landscape you can go into summer and scroll all the way down to the bottom i'm going to use this photo right here but my poster board is upside down down, so we will need to flip it and now we have a really pretty sunset another thing you want to make sure is that the poster board is behind the window like right now I can tell that it is in the glass I will need to move it backwards a little bit because you will notice once you move it backward there will be a purple tint that's how you know it is outside the window but if you close the window the purple tint does go away and you can put this in a both windows if you want. I think I'm going to do a different landscape over here just so we can see what different landscape, how they would look different. I might go into the fall one and see if I can't find a haunted house for Halloween for this next one. So this one right here is really good for Halloween. It looks like a haunted house and you have a witch leaving it. So there are a lot of landscapes that you can use in your windows. So here I have the same picture in both windows. The picture on the left is positioned differently so you can see the picture from a different angle so it looks like when you go to a different window you are looking at the landscape from a different angle. The spring section has a lot of cute outdoor scenery as well. Look how cute this is. So for this particular fabric I went into the spring section and I scrolled all the way down to the bottom and I am currently using this one but I bet you these two will look really cute as well. So the poster board is slightly too small for the balcony window so if you do want this hack with your balcony window, you will probably need to place something in front of it. I am going to put my bed back. In the fantasy section, I found this city landscape, which kind of reminded me of the buildings you can see out of the luxury apartments when you go onto your balcony. And also, I feel like it connects really well between all three windows, so I put that in my windows. And so here is what it looks like with the curtains on. It probably doesn't really look all that well on the balcony, so I would probably just put curtains to cover up the balcony door and only use this hack on the side windows like how I usually do it. Anyways, I feel like this is a very nice hack. It kind of helps make your dorm a little unique. And I just realized my windows are open. Let's go ahead and close those. And now you have a different outside. I hope you find this hack useful and if you want more dorm hacks, let me know down in the comment section down below. I could definitely do that. And please make sure you like, subscribe, and turn that bell notification so you never miss when I post. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!